Now I can remove array elements in a very similar way, except shift removes from the beginning, but it doesn't take any arguments. So if I have fruits and I say my fruit equals fruits.shift, then I get two things that happen. First of all, I remove apple from the beginning of the array, leaving me with banana and cherry as my array. But also, the element that I've removed goes into the myFruit variable. And now I can do something with that variable or that, that value that I've removed. So it's got kind of a dual purpose and it's very useful. Let's take a look at how that works. Uh, but first, uh, let's take a look at the, the analog to shift. And that is called pop, array.pop. Shift removes from the beginning, pop removes from the end. So they work exactly the same way. In other words, they, they take that element off the end, pop does, and then returns it and puts it into the variable that we assign it to. So now my fruit contains cherry and the fruits array contains apple and banana. So let's take a look at that in code. Okay, so if we want to take, let's say, banana, and let's put that into another variable, so if we want to take orange from the end of the fruits array and put that into another variable, let's try that out, and so that means we're going to use pop because pop takes things off the end and puts them into a variable. So I'm going to say my fruit equals fruits dot pop. Pop does not take any arguments, but you do have to include the parentheses for it to work properly because it is a method. And so fruits dot pop, we're going to put the result in fruits and then I'm going to take my fruit and send that to the screen in an alert. Okay, so both of those things should happen simultaneously. Let's save it and preview this and see if it works. So there is the my fruit. I've taken off the end using pop, so I get orange, and then apple and banana is what's left. So that worked. Pop takes it off the end. Now if I wanna take it from the beginning, I can Shift, and the same thing happens. We've got Apple that gets popped forward in the alert, and then what's left is Banana and Orange. So that is how to remove elements from an array using Shift and Pop.